It's happening. Netanyahu will soon reveal the Jewish Messiah. At the rapture, all living believers will be translated into heaven at least seven years before Christ's second coming. During these seven years, God's plans for Israel will be fulfilled. And even though not a single Bible verse says precisely when the rapture will take place concerning the tribulation or the second coming, that does not mean that the scriptures do not teach a clear position on this matter. In reality, it does, and quite clearly. One of the most powerful signs of the nearing rapture is the rise of Israel as a home for Jews and its plan to build the Third Temple. The re-establishment of Israel in 1948 and further expansion in 1967, in which it gained full control over what used to be Palestine, meant that Jews have once again established a Jewish kingdom in the Holy Land. Additionally, they have been trying to build the Third Temple in Jerusalem since then. However, they have not succeeded, because East Jerusalem, Bethlehem, and even Nazareth are Palestinian areas, and the Palestinians are quite fierce at protecting both Christian and Islamic sites and presence in Jerusalem. Many predict that Israel has given up on building the Third Temple in place of the Al-Aqsa Mosque because that would mean an all-out war and the demise of Israel. And since Muslims believe in Jesus as the Messiah and also in the God of Abraham, it would not be a holy war nor the beginning of Armageddon, since the Antichrist is not a believer and also comes with his army, kings of the east, and their 200 million soldiers of non-believers from east of the Euphrates River. Such a war would only mean that current Israel represents the first rise of the sons of Israel, and thus the rapture and Armageddon are still not upon us. As a result, the Israelis have been expelling the Palestinians living in areas adjacent to the Al-Aqsa Mosque in preparation to build the Third Temple there. Evidence points out that since the Euphrates River will be gone by 2050 at the most, the Third Temple will be built any time now. So, what does the Bible tell you as a Christian eagerly awaiting the rapture? The Bible clearly teaches that the Church and Israel are part of God's plan, but each serves a different purpose and is part of a different divine program. Israel cannot fulfill its part of the prophecy until God completes His current purpose with the Church and raptures His bride to heaven. Only pre-tribulationism provides a purpose for the rapture. That purpose is to remove the church via the rapture so God can complete his unfinished business with Israel during the seven-year tribulation period. Ephesians chapter 3 verse 10 His intent was that now, through the church, the manifold wisdom of God should be made known to the rulers and authorities in the heavenly realms. God's plan for Israel during the seven-year tribulation is the conversion of the Jewish remnant to the faith in Jesus as their Messiah. This will take place throughout the tribulation. By the end of the seven years period, the entire number of the elect remnant will become converted to Jesus. The Old Testament prophets speak frequently of the purging out of the Jewish non-elect during the tribulation. Ezekiel chapter 22 verses 17 to 22 Then the word of the Lord came to me, Son of man, the people of Israel have become dross to me. All of them are the copper, tin, iron and lead left inside a furnace. They are but the dross of silver. Therefore, this is what the Sovereign Lord says, Because you have all become dross, I will gather you into Jerusalem, as silver, copper, iron, lead, and tin are gathered into a furnace to be melted with a fiery blast. So I will gather you in my anger and my wrath, and put you inside the city and melt you. I will gather you and I will blow on you with my fiery wrath and you will be melted inside her. As silver is melted in a furnace, so you will be melted inside her, and you will know that I the Lord have poured out my wrath on you." The my wrath depicts the time of the tribulation. It also follows here that the nation must be regathered before that event can take place, and indeed they have in the current state of Israel. The current state of Israel is awaiting the purging fire of the tribulation that will remove the non-elect and reveal the remnant. The construction of the third temple will be the seal of what is coming, rapture and tribulation. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe, comment, and ring the bell so that every time we upload a video, you get notified.